Hello stars and welcome back to the Minecraft universe. This is Jason and today we are back with another episode of Double Mod Monday. So I didn't forget about that. You guys seemed to like it a lot last time. So be sure to leave a like this time if you want to keep it going and stuff. Uh, it seemed you guys like to see some mods that weren't too big, you know, but um, you know, they, they make a difference in your game. Somewhat anyways. So we're going to cover two more mods kind of like that today where they're just tiny. They're not big enough for their own mod review, but they're actually kind of cool. So um, yeah, the first one we're going to review here is the horse recipes mod. And it basically just makes every item that has to do with a horse craftable um, within, you know, just a workbench here. So I'm going to show you how to craft everything. Um, first, we're going to do the name tag name tags all these items I'm going to show you you can only find in dungeons um, otherwise so if you don't want to go venturing for dungeons before you can you know uh, tame your horse you just spawned next to you can go ahead and craft this stuff so here's a nice name tag you can name name your horse and you know just craft that there you go you got your name tag um, next up we got some horse armor we're gonna do all the different kinds uh, I believe it's just a piece of leather surrounded in it in whatever material you want the horse armor to be we got diamond here and then we can do uh, oh, oh god too much leather there. Okay, so then we can do like butter. You like you guys like butter. Um, and there you go. I got some butter horse armor. And then you got your iron horse armor. And there you go. There is that. Um, and then there's one more thing, and it is just the saddle, because we all know saddles are um, obtained through dungeons as well. So there you go. There's your saddle, and that is basically it. That is the horse recipes. Uh, mod it's really simple it won't change your game at all and you guys can just you know tame that horse you've always wanted to and you, you maybe you don't want to lose him or something maybe you don't want him to wander off before finding a dungeon and whatnot so you can go ahead and craft your stuff just like that and yeah that's about it and as you can tell um, this next mod does include <laughs> some uh, new new kind of diamond here it's called the black diamond this mod is called the uh, black diamonds mod and it's what are you doing on my crafting table? Get off, sheep. Okay, anyways, it's it's pretty cool. It's called the Black Diamonds mod. It makes it makes your diamonds purple, not necessarily black, but the purple comes from the obsidian, which is, I guess, basically black. But that's okay. It's called the Black Diamond. Sounds cooler than purple diamonds, I suppose. <laughs> so, um, yeah, basically, all you do to craft a black diamond is surround it in obsidian, and there you go. You got yourself a black diamond. And then, basically, you can just make tools with that black diamond. So, let's make, like, I don't know, a sword. You got your black diamond sword. And what's really cool, I just found that was awesome about this mod. It's super simple. Uh, there's a lot of mods out there that could potentially take over this kind of feeling. But uh, you can just make... Um, some tools that are just better than diamond. Um, it's just that simple. They're just better than diamond. So if I make a uh, diamond hoe, then I can make a shovel, I believe is our last tool. And there you go. That's the whole mod of black diamonds. Um, so you just use this stuff. So if you see right here in the creative menu, you got uh, diamond, diamond tools here. If we go to the sword, it says plus 10 attack damage. And then right here, you got plus 7 attack damage. So right off the bat, all these tools are just so much better. Um, so if I take a diamond pickaxe, let's test out the speed here. wonder if it's too much of a difference. It probably will be. It's supposed to be better than diamond. That's the whole point of the mod. Oh my god, I don't know why that was so hard to type. Okay. Um, let's just test it out. We're going to do diamond. It's pretty fast. And yes, this is definitely faster. You can actually tell a difference. I was, I'm actually surprised. I thought maybe you probably couldn't even tell a difference, but, but you sure can. So check that out. And then, and then, yep, yep, there's a difference. I, I enjoy, I enjoy this mod very much. See, it's, it's pretty simple. I like the way the tools are designed. It's just a simple, simple purple color, but it looks pretty cool. And, um, I would suspect something that kind of looks like that to be maybe even better than diamond like that. So it's, it's a really simple mod. Like, like, it says, like I said, this is a uh, double mod Monday, you know, simple mods coming out, but it, it's a cool mod, you know, it wouldn't change your game much. And if you ever need anything better than diamond, uh, then there you go. I mean, there's no armor. I don't know if he plans on adding armor or not, but, um, I'm okay with just tools right now. It's fine with me. Uh, but, uh, yeah, this is the Black Diamonds mod, and then we did the uh, Horse Recipes mod. So, hopefully you guys like both of those, and maybe you can add those to your game. Maybe change it up a little bit and whatnot. So, uh, yeah, it's, it's actually been a really short episode for showcasing two mods, but hopefully it was worth it. Maybe you guys can enjoy your game a little more with these two mods. But, yeah. 
Uh, I guess that's about it. Make sure you guys leave a like if you enjoyed um, and want to see some more Double Mod Mondays. Except maybe next time I'll try to find some mods that are maybe a little more extensive. That way the episode's not too short. But uh, the rule is two mods and it is Double Mod Monday. <laughs> but anyways, uh, yeah, that is it. I will talk to you stars later and see you guys. Yeah.